Crews are set to start clearing debris tomorrow in downtown Prophetstown, Illinois. A massive fire damaged or destroyed eight buildings there. KWQC's Danielle McCarthy joins us now. And Danielle, the community is really working together to make this cleanup possible. Yeah, the fire was a month and a half ago. And take a look here. This is how the town still looks today. The cleanup is expected to cost the city about $160,000. And the cost of the rebuild is still unknown. Donations have been rolling in, though, from the community to make it all a reality. And one of the biggest donations is coming from a group of people the city might never know. It's a town where people say everybody knows everybody. So we asked just about everybody if they knew a particular group of farmers. Have you heard of this group of farmers that is donating corn to raise money for the rebuilding fund? No. No, uh, no I haven't heard anything about that. I actually have not. You don't know who they are? I don't. It's unbelievable. It seems the mayor uh, may be the only one in town who does know about this group. The farmers in this area, a lot of them have come together and offered to donate sizable amounts for the cleanup and the rebuilding. And uh, the, I guess the part that gets me the most is they want to remain anonymous. That's right. Somewhere behind this field of corn is one of about a dozen farmers who want no recognition for what they're doing selling about $50,000 worth of corn at this grain facility and giving all the money to the city's rebuilding fund. A $50,000 donation to the city could be like night and day. Uh, that could get us out of the red for any cleanup expense. So why make such a big donation? We were lucky enough to track down one of those anonymous farmers to explain. I talked to Mayor, I says, what happens if the people don't have enough insurance and the city takes it over? And who's got to pay the difference? He said, well, the city will have to borrow the money and do it, you know. So I said, well, let me see what we can do. So that's what, that's what got it started. And while they may never know who these farmers are, the community has a few things they'd like to tell them. Well, I think it's great. Yeah, it's amazing. Whoever is doing it is amazing. But, you know, I kind of wish they'd let us know who they are so we could thank them. In Prophetstown, Danielle McCarthy, KWQC TV6 News. The mayor of Prophetstown says there are three businesses that are considering rebuilding on the site. He says those businesses could start to take shape by spring. Well, coming up after.